Bradley, you're not gonna intimidate me. Oh, yes I am. Because I've been preparing and I'm so ready to beat you at this ultimate pancake challenge. All right, Bradley. You wanted a rematch? Well, here it is. Last time didn't really go in your favor. Well, I'm so ready this time, okay? I have been eating, drinking, and sleeping pancakes. How do you sleep pancakes? Uh, I made a giant pancake so I could sleep on it like a bed. Duh. Okay, well, I haven't been doing any of that, but I'm pretty sure I'm still gonna win. No, so. no way, okay. It's time to put your pancake batter where your mouth is. It's time. Easy. So, I've set up this brand new, super awesome ultimate battle versus pancake challenge. I've come up with a super awesome theme for this challenge. Heroes versus villains. The best of three rounds wins. You will be using the random generator button to select your character for each round. And Bradley, you're up first. Let's start you off with a villain, since you're wearing your villainous purple shirt. Let's see who you get. All right, time for me to press the buttons. Here we go. Bradley was lucky enough to get me Pack Rat for his pancake, which means we are destined to win this round. <laughs> All right, let's see who I get. Superhero Gil? Oh, he has a lot of colors. I can still do him though. Yeah, I can, I can. It's fine. All right, let's get started with this Super Gil pancake. I don't know what to do. That's fine, we're getting started with our pancake now. All right, uh, let's get some tails. See, this is why you gotta sleep pancake, okay? You don't sleep pancake, you're unprepared like her. Look, just because I don't sleep pancake doesn't mean I can't make pancake, okay? Yes, yes, Ooh, yes it does. Too hot. 100%, that's exactly what it means. I'm starting on Pack Rat, and I, I need to make sure I layer him properly, so I can't just do his whole body first. I have to do the layers that are supposed to be on the bottom first, so I'm starting with the little pink parts of his ears. Now, uh, I think I need to do next maybe like uh, his mouth, maybe his tongue. Eh, I'm not sure about this plan of yours. It feels a little bit like you just made that up. However, the one thing I am sure about is that you better get my good side. I don't think I'm giving him big enough muscles. Uh, we're also just not even gonna try to give him a fist. We're just gonna give him flippers because that's a lot easier shape. It's easier to do this than this. Uh, I guess we're gonna work on his head. Oh, Gil, why do you have so many details? Come on, Bree. I don't have that many details. See, you got this. I'm working on Pack Rat's favorite part of himself, his mustache. Oh, dang, you're only doing the face. That looks so good. I should have only done Gil's face. Pack Rat doesn't have a lot of body. He's mainly just face. Oh, I see. Excuse me. I have no idea what you are talking about. My face is only half of my body, which is completely normal in the hamster community. Working on the face. He kind of looks a little walrusy at the moment. Uh, Hoping he comes out looking a little, a little more hamstery by the end of it. I'm a hamster, not a walrus, not a beaver. Hamster! You really need to learn more about animals and their basic anatomy. So I've come to grips with the fact that Gil's face is terrible. Uh, I think the only thing I really can do is just try to pack this thing with color. So let's get on adding color. Color is always good, and it uh certainly can't hurt at this point. This one's going pretty good for me. Bria, you make me realize how how amazing I truly am. <laughs> okay, he's he's morphed now from walrus to beaver. So I hope he I hope he's not pack rat the beaver. I don't know where my parts are. Pack rat is looking beautiful. B e a e. <laughs> Deepful, if I do say so myself. What do you think, Pack Rat? Any pancake based off me is the best pancake! I feel like if Gil were to see this pancake, his reaction would be like, oh no. Those are not Gil skills. Uh, I wouldn't say that. 
Oh, I forgot his fin to color it. No wonder. Oh, that's gonna make all the difference. I was gonna say. <laughs> no wonder. No oh. wonder. Oh, there he is. No, now it's perfect. Now, now it's we... something. So I accidentally miscolored his jaw because I was trying to do the inside of his mouth black, and I just colored the whole jaw black. It's quite wonderful. That sounds like a, that sounds like a kind of shark, a black jaw shark. Yeah, he's not a. What is Gil? Is he a great white shark? My final step is to fill in the cape, which is gonna give me the win because he's a superhero and superheroes have capes. Several minutes later. Boom. <laughs> now we wait <sighs> for my terrible upside down wrong colored Gil. Oh. Are you finally done? Well, kind of. Oh, I'm falling asleep over he here. Looks cute. No, I, I, I do not think cute was the word, but okay, cute. okay. Cute. Brie has given it a cute. Yes, because so. little tiny villains are cute. All right, it's time to do uh, the pancake flipperoo. Here we go. Too, too many bottles. Uh, okay. Come on, pack rat. Come on. I learned from last time oh, that I man. need to make it all one big big uh, pancake or else uh, you're gonna have parts breaking off. I got this one on uh, one spatula. I said I've been practicing, okay? Well, Watch this. Okay, Watch this right. sleep pancake. Oh! oh, check that out. All right, we're gonna flip. We are gonna flip. I wish somebody was kind enough to lend me their spatula oh. so no parts fall off. Well, I am kind enough to lend you Oh, my that's spatula. so sweet. Like a oh, well, oh, maybe made... maybe we are not ready to. Oh, you made it too thin. <sighs> All right, we're gonna flip this thing and see what it looks like. Oof, oof. Can I get an oof? Oof. There you go. <gasps> oh, ah! Ah! Okay. Oh, okay. Hey, you saved it. Uh, <laughs> except for I need this just. Scooch over a little bit. Yeah, it looks like it looks like Gil was eating a lot of black licorice. Kind kind of has it a little bit all over. Black licorice there. is terrible. I feel like if I put white, it's gonna ruin it. You know what? <laughs> We're just gonna accept it. You ready to plate? Yeah, let's plate these pancakes. I'm, I'm just ready for this round to be over. <laughs> all right, Gil, you are a super. You know what? I just figured it out. He's like. He's like lurking in the shadows and stalking villains, which is why I did the high contrast shadow on his face. Mm -hmm. He's also uh, gonna gonna lose this round. Uh, that's why my pancake's awesome. Okay, combo. Combo, is it gonna be your like your really best friend Gil no. that's gonna win this round, or some guy that tries to steal everything? Uh, but hey, he can be. He's he's really nice at. Okay, no, he's not. He's not nice at all, actually. But hey, he's it's a good pancake, darn it. Round one is complete. Now let's take a look at what Bree and Bradley have put together for their characters. So first we're checking out Bree's pancake of my good old buddy Gil. Ooh, and he's looking sharp in his superhero costume. His cape is looking good and I'm liking the centerpiece of his outfit. His face looks a little strange though. Maybe he's doing his superhero move or something and he's yelling out an attack. Or maybe Bree just messed up. <laughs> Not bad though. Let's see how Bradley did. Oh, this one looks pretty good. It's Pack Rat. Well, just his head. Maybe it's like his photo for school yearbook. I see the monocle on there. And that mustache is amazing. Gotta get that right for Pack Rat. It doesn't look like it's gonna fall off at all. This is a really good pancake. I think the winner is going to be Bradley. Yes, ha. Ah. Thank you, Combo. See, I knew he was gonna listen to me, okay? You've gotta go with a masterpiece of pancake art like this. <laughs> well, you know, the thing is with superhero versus villains is everybody loves a good underdog story and the hero always loses first and then they come back and win at the end, so. Ooh. Okay, okay, that's a good point. Let's get started on round two. Good luck, you guys. King Collector? Oh, I love King Collector. All right. I got this one. All right, this time I gotta give this one the old salt shaker, okay? It's my it's my perfect uh, button pressing style move. Uh, I gotta give it the old salt and pepper. Ooh, okay, super pack. Like, hey, I like super pack, okay? 
very, very cool outfit. He's got a cool weapon. I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do him justice here. All right, we have some catching up to do, and we are definitely gonna take round two with my king collector in his really sweet pod. Fly him through the sky. Nope. The pod's gonna, it's gonna crash land. Okay, no way. Excuse me, I am actually an excellent pod pilot, except for that one time in that pod race. But they were totally in my way. And that one time at the grocery store, but I was really hungry. Well, there was also that other time. Oh, uh, I gotta go. <laughs> hey, that wasn't there a few minutes ago. <laughs> no. Yes, that's what I like to hear. <laughs> Already? <laughs> yes, already and oh no, perfect. Oh no. My plan is working. Hex got already a lot going on with his design, but now I have to remember his new superhero outfit. He's a lot like Batman. Don't don't, don't tell Batman. Batman might might come after Pax. Listen, it's not going good. Um, oh yeah. I, I messed up Pax. He's he, I me I messed him up already. I gave him like sunglasses, not like his superhero. Glasses. Uh, they're a little far apart. <laughs> they're a lot of far apart. Oh gosh, that pancake is not looking very super or very peck. All right, so we're gonna do the most important part of King Collector because he's a king. I mean, the crown. Why, thank you, Bree, for recognizing my royal stature. All right, I have slept, drank, ate, uh, studied. I've become the pancake, okay? It was very dangerous. Bradley, I'm starting to think that you went about your pancake preparations all wrong. Perhaps you should have just practiced drawing pancakes. No, it leaked. Oh no, not on my pod. Excuse me. Oh. I wouldn't be worried, Bree. I made frog pack. <laughs> it's fine. I'm just knocking everything over, it's fine, it's totally fine, right? All right, let's do some flipping. Come on, Super Peck. He's got a cape, so I think he should be able to flip pretty good. I think I've let him, oop, he might be a little too underdone. Uh, I'm gonna try though, I'm gonna go for it. Uh, okay, my heart's gotta get out of the way. I made a heart, but whatever, we don't need it. <laughs> oh, poor Peck. Oh, no. Do you need a second one? Here. Wait, no, hold here, on. Here. Hold on, I got this! All right, my sword might break off. Uh-oh. Never! Ah! Oh, it's... A frog. No, uh, I wasn't gonna say frog. All right, all right, all right. I think I gotta... Hey! Whoa! Plating time. Time for me to get my victory on. Boom! Oh, no! Oh, no! This girl! <laughs> Oh. Totally fine. Oh man. Like it never happened. <laughs> All right, come on, Super Peck. Up, up. Oh no. And away. No, no, not that way. Not that away. <laughs> oh god. Uh, <laughs> no. Peck. Hurry, Bradley. Hurry, hurry. No, it's fine. Look, he can still be safe. Look. You just stay packed. The hero oh, can no. save us. It's fine, it's fine, put it together. Hurry, hurry. Pack. Oh no. Oh man. <laughs> <laughs> it's fine. And he lost his head now. No, it's fine. He's lost his head. He's fine. Oh, he's wait. lost his <laughs> arm, he's lost his how head. Did, how does this even go on? I'm so confused. Like that, yeah. perfect. All right, combo. You know, take a good look at both of these pancakes and you tell us who the winner of round two is. Ignore any heads that might be off the body. No, look, it's fine. He won't know. He won't notice. It's fine. Round two is over! Has Brie redeemed herself? Only one way to find out. Let's check out these round two pancakes. First up is Brie with King Collector. While I may not like King Collector, I've got to admit that it's a pretty good looking pancake. It looks just like him. It's got his evil smirk, his big machine, and his crown, of course. I've got to give that one a three crown points up. Now, let's check out Bradley's. Ooh, I see Super Pack. Although, he kind of looks like Evil Pack. I guess his outfit is throwing me off. Looking like Batman. 
He's missing his sword, though. And those eyes look really weird. They're way too far apart. Okay, very off for Peck. Not as super as he should be. So therefore, the winner is Bree. King Collector, thank you, buddy. Uh, that means we're tied one to one, and it's all the final round. Well, we'll see who wins next time. Bradley, could you put that pancake down? <laughs> that's horrifying. Well, guys, it looks like that's all the time we have for today's video. Bree and Bradley are tied up one to one, but who will come out ahead? Be sure to tune in next time to see the final round and winner of this Ultimate Pancake Challenge! Thanks for watching, everyone! Be sure to like and subscribe, and we'll see you later for the thrilling conclusion of Brie vs. Bramley! Bye!